This is what the old people told me when I was a child. Long ago, when the world was new, there were not many stars in the sky. In those days, people depended on corn for food. They would grind it and keep it in bins behind their homes. Bread made from cornmeal often kept them from starving during the long winter months. One morning, an old man and an old woman went to their bin for some cornmeal. What they found there upset them very much. The lid was off the bin. The level inside had dropped by a hand span, and there was cornmeal scattered over the ground. Surely no one in the village would steal from the elders. Who could the thief be? Now the old couple had a young grandson who loved them very much. When he heard about the stolen cornmeal, he decided he would be the one to catch the thief. That evening when Grandmother Sun had gone to rest and Elder Brother Moon was not yet in the sky, the boy went to his grandparents' home. He hid near the bin of cornmeal and waited. Late that night, the boy saw an eerie light coming across the fields. When it was closer, he saw it was in the shape of a great dog. The dog nosed the lid off the bin and began to eat. When it had eaten its fill of the cornmeal, the dog turned and ran through the woods into the night. The boy lay in his hiding place, not quite believing what he had seen. But in the morning, the cornmeal scattered around the bin there were tracks of a giant dog. When the boy told the people what he had seen, no one knew what to do, so they decided to go to the beloved woman, a leader among the people. She was old and wise and understood many things. When the beloved woman looked at the tracks, she said, these are the tracks of a creature like no dog on this earth. It is a spirit dog and have, has great power. We must be very careful. The beloved woman, instructed the people to gather all their drums and turtle shell rattles. We will hide near the cornmill bin and wait. When the giant dog comes, we will make a great noise. The people hurried to get their drums and rattles. Then they hid near the old couple's cornmill bin. It grew dark and a few stars sparkled in the sky. Soon they saw the shining form of the great spirit dog coming across the fields. It was so big that many of the people were frightened and wanted to run. But the beloved woman whispered, do not be afraid, wait for my signal. The great dog came to the bin and began to eat, filling its big mouth with the white cornmeal. Now, the noise was as loud as the thunderer when he speaks. The great dog leaped in fear and began to run, but the people chased it, still beating their drums and shaking their rattles. <laughs> the dog, great dog ran, white cornmeal spilling from its mouth. It ran till it came to the top of a hill and leaped up into the sky. <laughs> it ran across the sky until the people could see it no longer. But the cornmeal that had spilled from its mouth remained. Behind is a great band of light across the sky. Each grain that fell became a star. Just as the beloved woman had said, the great dog never bothered them again. But where it ran across the sky was left a pattern of stars the Cherokee call Gilitsun Stanui. The place where the dog ran. That is how the Milky Way came to be.